Revo Uninstaller. Now this is a nice easy program to use. When you open it, you're presented with this. A very fast loading page which shows all of your installed programs. Now to uninstall, let me pick this one. Select uninstall. Click yes. You then have options to run the applications uninstaller without any additional scanning, safe, moderate, advanced. I will use the advanced one. Click next. It creates a restore point first. It analyzes the application's data before uninstalling it. It then asks you if you're sure you want to remove this. The answer is yes. Next, it will now scan to see if there are any files or folders left, as well as registry entries. When it's finished scanning, click Next. Tick that box. It will take out all of this from the registry that it doesn't need. Select Delete. Yes. Next. That one can go. Delete. Yes. That's it. Completed. It has removed WavePad from the folder. Now this is a lot quicker than the Add, can add Remove applet found in Windows. Under Tools you have the Auto Run Manager where you can start or stop applications from auto running. Windows Tools, you have a host of different tools here to use. Properties, Shared Folders, Services, Keyboard and the Add Windows Components. The Junk Files Cleaner do a quick scan and it will show you these. All you have to do is click delete. And that's it, that's that done. Browser cleaner. If you use Explorer, tick all five. Firefox, tick all five. Opera and Netscape applies the same. And just execute. It does much the same as CCleaner does. Microsoft Office. It will clear the most recent documents in Word, Excel, Access, PowerPoint and Front Page. Windows Cleaner. These are traces that you clean from the registry and traces on the local hard drive. Evidence Remover. Select a drive. Execute and it will clean all previously deleted files that were deleted through the recycle bin. Now, if you use the hunter mode, click on this one. I will put a program there. I'll put, there's the hunter. Uninstall. Yes. No installation package found. Now, as it didn't find an installation package, what you can do is kill and delete the process. You just click yes. That's it. Gone. On the hunter mode, simply right click it, open the main window and you're back to where you started. It's a very easy program to use. And this will just work through and erase all previously deleted stuff through the recycle bin. It takes a while uh, so just let it run. Just go away, have a coffee or whatever. I hope you find this of some use. If you get any problems leave a comment on the blog and I'll get back to you.